Back to Virginia Beach and a Navy spouse looking to clear her name after that name got her arrested. She got hauled in for a warrant out of Baltimore County. The first and last name were right, but the middle name and the person were wrong. Not to mention the injuries she said she suffered when base police searched her. Henry Shots Kiana Patterson has a story new tonight. Wow, Kiana, how did this all happen? Well, Jacqueline A. Smith calls this nothing short of a nightmare when she was brought here to jail in Virginia Beach and booked under Jacqueline R. Smith, which is not her name. It was a usual trip to J.E.B. Little Creek two weeks ago that led to an aggressive arrest of Navy wife Jacqueline Alceda Smith with her newborn in the back seat. Is this how you treat a service member's wife? Like, is this how you're treating a new mother? Smith says base police were so rough she started bleeding as she was taken to Virginia Beach City Jail, where she was booked under the wrong name, Jacqueline Renee Smith. They fingerprinted me. They took mug shots of me under this person's name. Her family worked for two days to clear the mix up. To have to strip naked, to have to spread and cough, and all while I'm experiencing a medical emergency. Smith said she was ignored by everyone. The Navy police, the Virginia Beach PD, and the sheriff's office, they were picking and choosing when to use my correct name. The court documents still show the wrong name, which belongs to a woman wanted for aggravated assault in Baltimore County. Now the identities have been blurred. Paperwork shows VBPD began to have concerns of the identity, adding a police lieutenant noticed inconsistencies with the fingerprints. Smith was later released with a $5 bond. That was the extent of their, their, their sorry. The mom of two had to hire an attorney for an extradition hearing last week. It was just merely to address, are we gonna extradite this person or not? Now it's on her to navigate how to correct all of the legal documents and get the case expunged from her record. I'm just thankful that there are people who are willing to listen to my story. And Virginia Beach police say they are now doing an internal investigation into the officer's action. Virginia Beach Sheriff's Office released a statement. I'll share that over on wavy.com. But Smith says it is not over. She is doing a petition and she plans to speak before city council next Tuesday. In Virginia Beach, Kiana Patterson, turn on your side.